Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do y'all summons for y'all for April the 30th until next Sunday, which is May the 7th, okay? I'm doing a little bit different. We'll be reading Jeremiah, my son name, Franny Sister 13 in the Old Testament, okay? Um, y'all know who killed Jeremiah was Ed Grain, Albert Fisher, Charmaine Maxwell, and the Night Stalker. He will wear the suit, okay? So let's see what they have to tell, tell me and my family. How they? Let me see what they have to tell me and my family by my son Jeremiah. <clears throat> but um, thirteen gonna be the most important one. In in the beginning of the reign of Jehoiakim, the son of Josiah, king of Judah, this word came from the Lord. The Lord says, stand in the court of the Lord's house and speak to all the cities of Judah, which come to worship in the Lord's house, all the words that I command you to speak to them. Don't omit a word. It may be they, are, it may be they will listen and every man turn from his evil ways, that I may relent from the evil which I intend to do to them because of the evil of their doings. When I spank Jeremiah. Okay. Um, that's on my part. That's my evil part. I spanked my son. And on um, Hussein part, he was a beat me. Okay, so, I mean, I, I don't think me not me spanking my child, y'all have right to take my son and sell him. That's evil. What I did, not evil. Because I tell him to my stay in a kid place and, and go in your room. Okay, anyways. <clears throat> you shall tell them. The Lord, they were, they were they telling Jeremiah to say to us. Okay? He, he talks to me in his music. He sings to me in his music. Only to me. You shall tell them, the Lord says, if you will not listen to me, to walk in my law, which I have set before you, to listen to the words of my servants, the prophets, whom I sent to you, even rising up early and sending them, but you have not listened, then I will make this house like Shelah, and will make this city a curse to all the nations of the earth. Okay. I don't I I don't um I don't get I don't get I don't get I don't get bad luck when I listen to my son music. Now when I listen to my group Brownstone, I do. Okay, like I get I feel down. I don't feel down with my son music. But this is what it's this is what it's supposed to do though. The priests and the prophets and all the people heard Jeremiah speaking these words in the Lord's house. See, the Lord's house, they get inside my son's body suit. But my son is the one who, he's a zombie. He actually talking while they in his house sleep. Let me read again for you. The priests and the prophets and all the people heard Jeremiah speaking these words in the Lord's house. When Jeremiah had finished speaking all that the Lord has commanded him to speak to all the people, the priests and the prophets, and all the people seized him, saying, You should you shall surely die. Okay, yes. The people that get inside his fucking body suit to smell his blood, like what the fuck? Okay. Why have you prophesied why have you prophesied? prophesized in the Lord's name, saying this house will be like Sheila and this city will be desolated without inhabitants. All the people were crowded around Jeremiah in the Lord's house. Yes, my son got fans. Um, but yes. When the princes of Judah heard these things, they came up from the king's house of the Lord's house. And they sat in the entry of the new gate of the new gates of the Lord's house. Okay. The king is Jeepa Creeper, y'all. Okay. You're gonna wanna know why and how? Because they took they they remember they took Jeepa Creeper's power and they and they whatever the hell they took from Jeepa Creeper's power, they stick it into my son. And they stick it into them they self too. Before they get in my son body suits. Okay. Remember, it was Jeepa Creepers was on the cross, and Charmaine was on the cross. I assume it was Jeepa Creepers that killed now my son, but it was actually Charmaine because she took his power, and she could fly, and she, and she don't tape. Anyways, um, this is what they're saying. When the princes of Judah heard these things, they came up from the king's house. 
But they took his body, they took, they took his blood and drunk it to the Lord's house. They sat in the entry of the new gates of the Lord's house. Then the priests and the prophets spoke to the princes and to all the people, saying, This man is worthy of death, for he has prophesied against this city, as you have heard with your ears. Then Jeremiah spoke to all the princes and to all the people, saying, The Lord sent me to prophesy, prophesy against this house and against this city all the words that you have heard. Now therefore amend your ways and your doings, and obey the Lord, your God's voice, them. Then the Lord will relent from the evil that he hath pronounced against you. Okay, that was the main important one right there. Let me read it again for you. My mind just went blank. Now, therefore, amend your ways and your doings, and obey the Lord, your God's voice. Then the Lord will relent from the evil that he had pronounced against you. Okay, it could be for multiple people. It could be for um, Jeepers Creepers to my family lineage or to my son. Um, I feel like I'm in trouble with Jeeper Creepers, hell. My son feel like he's in trouble with Jeeper Creepers. And Jeeper Creepers feel like he's in trouble, okay? So, you know, that's what we got from that's what I got from that. But we not though. But as for me, behold, I am in your hands. Do with me what is good and right in your eyes. This is what Jeeper Creepers telling us, okay? He is a demon. I ain't gonna lie, he is a demon. And he but he he did talk to the most high about this. The most high did talk to him about this. He can't understand, okay, and um, this is what he's saying, okay? But as for me, behold, I am in your hand. Do with me what is good and right in your eyes, okay? Only know for certain that if you put me to death, you will bring innocent blood on yourself, on this city, and on its inhabitants, for the truth the Lord has sent me, to you to speak all the words in your ears. Jeeper Creeper said he did not. Okay. Um, but Jeremiah was innocent blood. Okay. We are innocent in this. Then the princes and all the people said to the priests and to the prophets. This man is now worthy of death. For he has spoken to us in the name of the Lord our God. Then certain of the elders of the land rose up and spoke to all the assembly of the people, saying, Micah, the Moshitite, prophesied in the days of Hezekiah, king of Judah, and he spoke to all the people of Judah, saying, The Lord of hosts says, Zion would be plowed as a field. See, they were happy it wasn't a field. And Jerusalem would become heaps in the mountain of the houses as the high places of a forest. Watch Jeeper Creepers 2, the beginning of it. It basically what happened. The Hikiah, king of Judah, and all Judah put him to death. This and he feared the Lord and in yeah, Jeeper Creepers, shit. Yeah. The way I, 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 I be saying, like, they kind of they kind of worship him. They're not really, they don't worship him, but they take they 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 stole from him, basically. The Hikiah, king of Judah, and all Judah put him to death. They thought they killed him. Yeah. Did then he fear the Lord and increased the, fla the favor of the Lord, and the Lord relented of the disaster which he had pronounced against them. We will commit great evil against our own souls of that way. See, they in trouble. There were also a man who prophesied in the Lord's name, Uriah, the son of Shemaiah of Kirai Jeremy, and he prophesied against this city and against this land according to all the words of Jeremiah. Okay, he did not know. Um, when Jehakim, the king, which all his mighty men and all the princes heard his words, the king sought to put him to death. But when Uriah heard it, heard it, he was afraid and fled and went into Egypt. Okay, Jeba Quippus, remember? He's a demon. They took him out of his kingdom to put him, put him on, on this earth. He like, what the fuck? Um, and they fetched Uriah out of Egypt and brought him to Joachim, the king who killed him with the sword and cast his dead body into the graves of the coming people. But the hand of Achikan, the son of Shaphan, was, he said they killed his peoples too in his kingdom too. 
was with his son, with Jeremiah, so they didn't give him into the hand of the people to put him to death. One more time. But the hand of Achim, the son of Shaphan, was with Jeremiah, so they didn't give him into the hand of the people to put him to death, okay? Well, that's Jeremiah chapter 26, 13, okay? Hope y'all enjoy. I'm out. Peace.